Let's try to solve this problem. Simplify the following. So let's start with 1. x to the 5th over x squared. So to simplify this expression, we can apply the division law of exponents wherein if we have x raised to m over x raised to n. So if you are dividing same base x, we just copy the same base x and subtract the exponents. So exponent on the numerator m minus exponent on the denominator n. So if we apply this on the problem, we just copy the same base x and subtract the exponent. So we have 5 minus... 2. So we will have x raised to 5 minus 2 or 3. So the final answer is x cubed. For number 2, we have 2 to the 6th over 2 cubed. So again, we are dividing same base 2. So let's just copy the base 2 and then subtract the exponents. So we have 6 minus 3. So 2 raised to 6 minus 3 or 3. If we simplify this further, 2 cubed means 3 factors of the base 2, so it's equal to 2 times 2 times 2, 3 factors of base 2. So if we multiply 2 times 2 times 2, it's equal to 8. For number 3, we have negative 36x to the 7th over 4x to the negative 8. So before we apply the division law of exponent for the base x, let's just divide the coefficients. Negative 36 divided by 4, that will be negative 9. And applying division law of exponent, we just copy the base x and subtract the exponents. We have 7 minus negative 8. So we'll have negative 9 x raised to 7 minus negative 8. It's the same as 7 plus 8 or 15. So the final answer is negative 9 x to the 15. Next for number 4, we have... 10x to the negative 3, y to the 8, z to the 9th, over 8x to the negative 5, y to the 4th, z to the negative 11. So, we can divide first or simplify the coefficients. So, 10 over 8, we can reduce that to lowest term. As, so, we can factor out the 10 as 5 times 2. 8, we can factor as 2 times 4. So, we can cancel out the 2. We are left with 5 over 4. Then, for the same base x, we can divide. Applying division law of exponent, copy the base x and subtract the exponents. We have negative 3 minus negative 5. Or if we simplify negative 3 minus negative 5, it's equal to negative 3 plus 5 or simply positive 2. Then, for y to the 8 over y to the 4th, copy the base y and then subtract the exponent 8 minus 4 or simply y to the 4th. Lastly, for the base z, copy the base z and subtract the exponents 9 minus negative 11. 9 minus negative 11 is equal to 9 plus 11 or equal to 20. So, the final answer is 5 over 4 x squared y to the 4th z to the 20th power. Okay, now it's your turn. So try to solve this problem and just comment your answers.